I will give you this one and only point. He looks more like a Digimon than any Pokemon, and that gives him a slight leg up. Oh, you like Digimon? Yeah? I... Digimon's way better than Pokemon. Yeah, I know. I, I, will, I will argue that to the death. Hey, buddies! Welcome back to Chris and Any Play. Today we're playing Parasite Eve 2. I don't know if I was supposed to leave. I and, just, and by I just two, left. I mean T-O-O. -O. We're playing it as well as talking about Pokemon and Digimon. And, uh... So, last time we were talking about legendary Pokemons and, and how I was incorrect in uh, my association with uh, Lucario being the legendary from Silver. He is not. That was Lu Lugia. Uh, both start with L and I don't care. Uh, I was talk We were talking about Digimon and whether or not... Which one came first in uh, North America? Um, now, it was 98 when Pokemon actually finally came out as a Game Boy game. And, and I believe very shortly after, I don't believe the anime uh, hit... TV show uh, airwaves beforehand, uh, but it did show up. Uh, I do believe at the same time uh, Digimon was airing about, I can't, I can't exactly tell, uh, but before we got the Digi uh, the Pokemon uh, game for Game Boy, we did for certain uh, receive the Digimon handhelds, which were um, like Tamagotchi, which if you don't know what it is, Tamagotchi is a digital pet, uh, which was like a little egg with a little tiny LCD screen that you could basically... Uh, prevent from dying. That was your job. Yeah, that's uh, basically all it did. Yeah, that, it? that was the game. Prevent it from dying. Like, I mean, you could let it walk and clean up its shit and feed it. That 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 was your options. Uh, Digimon was the same thing, only it had the option of, like, how you treated it. Like, its levels of whether or not you fed it and cleaned up its shit properly. It could evolve a little bit, but here's the kicker. When you connected it to another Digimon device, you could fight them. I, uh, I remember the whole, like, because training was basically you entered training mode and you kept tapping this button to keep training yeah, yeah. so like my friends and i we'd be in school am i yeah oh yeah. right sorry yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'd be in school um get me in the store playing but like you know in class so it just looked like we're like just jerking off under our desks <laughs> trying, to, trying to train so we can fight you, damn kids stop jerking off i'm <laughs> so jerking off and playing pokemon so i mean battle the, the digimon games in my pocket battle in between classes yeah, yeah. <laughs> So yeah, that, there's that's that. So anyways, though, the whole reason oh, this game. Oh yes, this gun's so much better. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, uh, is it a new gun or is it like? It, a, yeah, it dropped from the T-Rex. Did it, you manage it, to move all your shit to it or? Yep. Now like it only shoots once, so it does like max oh, damage then it per must shot. Be epic. And I can enter two commands. Ooh. So like, duh, and then I can use a spell as well. That's cool. That's so crazy. So this whole conversation got brought about because I decided. Did I? I don't even know. I don't even know why it came about. Yeah, why the, why are we talking about Pokemon? Oh, like we were talking, well, we're talking Lucario. about Pokemon because of like the the Triceratops with lightning. Oh right, right. There you go. And then oh, because yeah, you were something about a legendary. Or, okay, yeah, I remember. Yeah. Uh, oh, excuse me. So maybe I should play Pokemon. Maybe we should play it for the channel. I don't know. Uh, tell you what, if uh, if you guys want to see us play Pokemon, mm -hmm. leave us a comment uh, and and like the video for us. Uh, you know, if this this video somehow manages to get to, I don't know, thirty five likes, we'll play Pokemon. Oh, yeah. that's wow! You just made a commitment. Yeah, yeah. Like the video thirty five times. Make yeah. some dummy accounts. Like it. That's actually not unrealistic. If it gets thirty five views, thirty five likes is not unreasonable. Yeah. And here's hey. here's okay. Here's just a request. Even if you don't like the video, totally. And just just like it anyway. Just because now I want. I want Chris to do a blind Nuzlocke run of... I suppose the Pokemon game can be of the viewers choosing, because we technically have all of them available to us. From, like, friends and stuff. Like, I don't I don't have them all. I have Silver, Black, and X or I, something. I know he managed to say words. I don't even know what some of them are. Okay, I just went where I was supposed to go, and yeah. I lost already. Wait. So... Wait. Yeah. Because I'm on the wrong floor. 35 okay. likes, I'll play Pokemon, however Andy has required me to do so. Uh, you can just play it regular, I guess. You don't have to do a blind Nuzlocke, whatever. I uh, Just, like, to make it, like, interesting, because, like, everyone plays Pokemon. Who cares? But, like, they do They still some... have, like, some of the original in the games, like, the new ones? Like, um, I still oh, got, yeah, like, totally. Yeah, so, like, I can get, like, myself, like, a Magikarp and, like, not do anything. Like, I can flail or possibly, if I'm lucky, tackle. Yeah. All right, sweet. They're all, they're all in there, man. All of them? 
yes, they're not all obtainable through like traditional means, but yes, you can get them all. It is possible. Game Shark, it is. Usually through like trading or like importing or whatever, but yeah. like it's doable. All right. We'll do it. We'll find some like cute little bastards and I'll get them all beat up and shit. And Nurse Joy will be like, You're a horrible person! And I'll be like, I'm a fucking kid. I'm like, You should know better! And then, I don't know better. I'm a kid. I'm like, What, what is the age that you can start training Pokemon? Like, uh, I don't know. It was like 8 or 13 or. Well, are you going by like Ash or just like the random kindergartners that you beat up? <laughs> Well, I meant like Ash, because like Ash is like the like he's. I'm finally get to be a trainer and all that yeah, stuff. He's, he's like, like ten or something. Maybe. He's like, yeah. oh, I'm finally turned the trainer age, and now I don't have to see my mother ever again. And Wait, she's... does he actually say like now I'm like trainer age? I think so. Because you I totally think... fight. Even Ash, I think in the show, challenges younger kids than him. That doesn't make sense. Yeah, well, I think it's different to you like just why? have Pokemon. <laughs> like it's like. Because, like, Pokemon are, like, own, like they're just, like, the name for animals in the universe of Pokemon, right? Like, I mean, like, if you had, like, a cat, like, if you're, like, a six-year-old and you're, like, I've got a Pokemon cat! I got a Meowth! Well, the difference is, like, dog fights and stuff are, like, illegal in our world. And children don't generally get into I suppose it depends those. on where you are. I mean, like, in certain areas, I just don't know that they're illegal, just sort of frowned upon. Yeah, it's a fair point. Um, yeah, I, I, was, I probably shouldn't... I, I, criticize Pokemon writing as if like it should be better it's atrocious atrocious and okay. it's always been that way always will man that is a bad show I tried watching it when it came out and even then I was like ugh I can't my my like back then I was just like must watch anything anime available to me but even yeah, that totally. I was all in that even that was just like this yeah, is totally. too bad I can't watch it well for a while there like uh Unfortunately, I haven't been for a little while, so if you're a Canadian viewer or you're from the northern United States, you may know of a convention here called Anime North. And uh, for 11 years running, I had been to every one of them from my age, from the age of 16. Um, and pretty much every year, they, they showcase, like, the new series of Pokemon. And, um, you know, for, like, they'd have, like, a Saturday morning cartoons theater thing where you'd come in and you'd sit down and watch them. And, like, I'd be like... Yay, I'm watching the shittiest version of Beyblade they've created yet. <laughs> For years, I've trained to lose this top. And then, like, a dragon would come out and be like, I'm a dragon! Oh, I'm dead! Um, <laughs> so I would do that. And, like, for, like, almost every year, they'd have, like, um, this year's season of Pokemon. So um, I watched a lot of the seasons. Not, like every episode or anything but i've seen like oh there's a pocket music like dragon mouth and stuff this is scary is the bad things gonna happen i feel like bad stuff is gonna happen every cutscene is a bad thing happening in this game oh now i understand so anyways uh, i ended up watching a bunch of seasons like the first two episodes of like every season basically and i got to the point where like uh, i'm just like first off ash doesn't grow like at all like, he doesn't seem to, like, get smarter, or new Pokemon, <laughs> or age, you know, but, like, he's traversed multiple continents and different areas and created all this stuff and be like, look at this, I'm gonna, I'm like, I'm finally a new area, I'm gonna be the best. And then you get there and he's like, hey there, little girl, and she'd be like, yeah, I've got a Pokemon friend, look at me. <laughs> and then they go on some adventure where the Pokemons dance. And then this is the end of the episode, and I'm like, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> what the shit is this? Like, I, I want two things to have for Pokemon. Uh, either or, either or. Number one, never show me another fucking episode ever again. That means just end it. That's it. We're over. Okay, we're <laughs> this done. This is what I want to see from Pokemon. Nothing. Just, yeah. just stop just existing. Stop, stop. <laughs> Number two is I want it to get brutally violent. Oh. E one or the other. I want it either to never show up again, or I want, like... Pikachu to get so brutally, like, messed up and, like, crippled for the rest of the damn thing. Oh, this is awkward. <laughs> this is creepy. What the hell is that? Yeah. I'm gonna get, like, a broken leg or some shit from these, like, underground, like, animal wars. What is going on here? Do you have any idea what's going on in the story in this game at this point? Yeah, she's giving birth to the ultimate being. That's gross. 
Eve, uh, sorry, I, Beef's 41 walks in. She's like, oh, uh, when are you expecting? She's like, Shh. I'm not pregnant. I'm just fat. Shh. Shh. I'm, I'm just big boned. I'm just weirdly fat. Just be- oh, okay, that's much more acceptable. Now we just got all creepy and weird. It's all like spiderweb veins. <laughs> Ugh. Those aren't veins, by the way. They're arteries. Do you know the difference between arteries and veins? Uh, for, let's, uh, for the sake of argument, say I don't. So you can explain to the viewers. Okay, so I totally do. <laughs> All right, so arteries <laughs> carry blood to something and veins take them back. So the idea is that, like, uh, veins will have... Uh, oh, sorry, arteries will take the blood that's fresh from the lungs and it'll be bright red um, because it's got the oxygen that has change the iron in the blood content, right? And it'll take it there, and then when the muscles get it, they'll be like, I want all the oxygen, and take it away, and then the blood turns oh, not red, and it takes it back, which is why the veins are then discolored and blue. Because there's no oxygen content in them. I am covered, like, head to toe with big blue veins. Like, they're so visible. That is... Every time, honestly, I see these goo monsters, and I'm, like, I'm really, like, unsettled. <laughs> Like, it's... Where did you get giant goo bones? What if there was, like, a fruit drink that was that color? Would you drink it? No. No? Yeah, like, not like... It was all. It wasn't all, like, thick and gross. And it, it wasn't was just, viscous? It was, it it was, was just that just, color. No, well, then it's just juice. Like, well, this isn't juice. This juice. is... This is, like, viscous. This is, like, the b- in-between between juice and jello. What if there was a jello that color? Would you eat it? It's still... It's Yeah, because it's jello. Like, I mean, if it was Jello Shake, where you like, it was like drinking a gummy bear. Oh. Oh, something about that grosses me out. Yeah, <laughs> see, that's what I'm talking about. Like, drinking gummy bears. That's what these things are. That's what I get from this. Is like, these are like, like gummy bear things that are like, they're just not quite solid yet. Are they, are they bouncing here and there and everywhere? Yeah. Okay. Holy we shit, they're the driving fucking fast. <laughs> I know, they're like... That's like... No, tra- time travel speeds. <laughs> that is like four... That is that is over 500 miles per hour. <laughs> They've gone plaid. <laughs> yeah. Well, you. I'm sure everybody... Most people have seen the pod race scene from the first episode of Star Wars. I think that is a fair thing to say, Yes. Mo- yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay, well, the film footage, the way how fast that's moving, is the equivalent if you were driving a vehicle at about 600 miles per hour. Well, when you play the pod racing game... It's they, not they, as fast. But, I mean, like, you have a speedometer, and you're going, like, about that speed, aren't you? Well, no, like, what I'm saying is, like, scientifically, is if you took, like, film footage, like, at that speed, that's how fast it's supposed to be going. Like, pod racing game doesn't move as fast as that. Okay, but I'm just saying, like... the. You might not actually be going that fast, but they're telling you you're going that yes, fast. That's yes. all. Yo, did you ever play? It was on N64, I believe. It was a racing game called Extreme G. I did not. Okay, it was like you were on these like motorcycles, mm-hmm. and the race track was usually like a half pipe type thing or full pipe. Uh, I'll finish this on the next episode, I suppose. And the next episode might be the end of the game. Holy shit, this destroyer! Because we're almost we're. Let's, go- let's finish this destroyer cutscene. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's it. We'll see you later. Bye bye. How fast is Daniel driving? How is that even possible? No car can move that fast. That that, that beast of land speed record. <laughs> Get your games together, developers. Learn how to accurately represent lights moving in vehicles. Sorry, I. I, I that's explosive. <laughs> I, I, I was just. <laughs> I was kind of. I, I didn't mean to leave you hanging there. It wasn't a bad joke. I just I was mesmerized by this. I haven't seen this in a long time. Oh, yeah. Well, actually, no, it was about a year ago. I think I already said. Yeah. I just forgot. Yeah. Lorraine!